My name is Matt McShan. I'm with Lone Star Armature. We are going to spend a few minutes to talk about the newly released Worldwide Electric ODP motor. A couple of things that, that we, we really like about the Worldwide motor. The, the first thing is the fit and finish. It's, it's just a really impeccably clean motor. They have really beefed up the end bells and this motor is really designed to take a heavy load and because they're so beefy, misalignment belt tension is super critical but you know if there was a motor you could get away with with a little bit of wiggle room, it would be this motor. There are steel baffles as opposed to a plastic or a fiberglass baffle. This motor was really built and designed overkill, which is great. Steel baffles is just something you, you don't typically see in a motor like this, and that little item really uh, goes to show you how much engineering and quality has gone into this motor. The leads are color-coded, 16 gauge on the three horse, so they have upsized the leads compared to the competitors. They have color-coded them to make it as easy as possible for installation. They have neatly labeled each lead that aligns with the wiring diagram found on the nameplate. They even clip the insulation on the wires so you can just easily remove it and it's ready for connection. So, I mean, how easy does it get? This motor is an inverter duty, 10 to one ratio, constant torque, 20 to one variable torque. So that, that's pretty standard in today's premium efficient motors. So most of these motors are today used in conjunction with a variable frequency drive. Uh, this motor is not outfitted with a shaft grounding ring in the event you would like that accessory. However, Worldwide has pre-drilled holes in the end bell to quickly install and, and bolt on a shaft grounding ring. Not every motor needs a shaft grounding ring and we can do it inexpensively because of preparation that Worldwide has done. And if they don't need it, we obviously, we have the same motor on the shelf. Another great feature of this motor, you've got two lifting eyes. Typically, a motor like this, you'll have one small lifting eye in the center of the motor. This one gives you two points of pickup. It's safer, honestly, than, than one in the center. Gives you a, a little more capability when you're trying to position this motor in and install it. The finished product we have here will compete with any motor manufacturer in the industry. 